And I also can't wait for this next segment, Shannon. Okay, okay today is National Lipstick Day. Okay. That's when you say yay. Oh, yay! Yay! And in honor of the occasion, <laughs> Ebony Magazine's beauty editor, Melanie Yvette Martin, has brought us this summer's hottest shades. All right. I'm so excited. Melanie, what did you bring for me to wear today? today? I bought you something. Don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> no, I got goodness. you. But Melanie, so who are you wearing? Because that I'm, lipstick color is incredible. I'm wearing Buxom in Exhibitionist. It's actually this one right here. I like snuck some on before we came out. I love it because I'm a hot pink girl. Yeah. You know, so I love lips. Lipstick is my thing. Really? So, yes. And sometimes it's hard to find hot pink on chocolate girls like us. Very but this much. really pops. I like it. I think the trick with chocolate girls mm -hmm. is to always go bolder than you would normally go. Okay. I think we get really self-conscious about it sometimes mm -hmm. because we've been taught that, you know, dark girls don't do color. pink lipstick. Like bold bright color. pink lipsticks. Yeah. No. Go bold and it'll pop against your complexion. All right. Yes. I like so that. Does that same too. concept work with other shades? You know, it really depends. Like, Today, I have the trends of the summer, and we have nudes, we have corals, we have pinks, and we have bold colors, and we also have reds. You have to be very specific about the shades. It's really about the undertones of the lipsticks. It's mm. not about the color. Any woman can wear any color. You just have to find the right tone. So it's really trial and error, to be honest with you. All right. Before we get to that, can mm -hmm. we talk about some lipstick fun facts? Yes. While I was researching this segment, I was like, <laughs> ooh, very cool. So, did you know that in the 1700s, a husband could annul his marriage mm -hmm. if he suspected that a woman tricked him into marriage by using lipstick? What? Did you know that? Are you serious? Yeah. Yes. Like, I did not know that. Lip yes. color and be like, but if he was baby. like, prawn! <laughs> I know, I know. <laughs> Those aren't your ruby red lips. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> he could <laughs> dump her. Can you believe that? That's crazy. That's kind of unbelievable. All right, That's another crazy. fun fact. Isn't this, this fun? This is fun. All right. <laughs> During the Middle Ages, <laughs> lipstick was made using sheep fat. Ooh. Ew. Sheep fat. You yeah, well, I mean, lips? sometimes lipstick is made with some crazy things nowadays, so. Uh -huh. Well, today, a, uh, good point. <laughs> today good point. a lot of lipsticks contain fish scales and fish oil because they supposedly okay. make lips shiny. Okay. I didn't oh. want to know okay, last fun fact. Yeah, okay. Is okay. it a Here's gross one. fact like that one, though? No. <laughs> no, this is a good one. This okay, is okay. actually the benefits of shopping. Okay. During wo World War II, lipstick sales soared in the UK because Winston Churchill believe makeup was good for morale during the war. That's interesting. See? interesting. Okay. And did you know that 80% of American women wear lipstick, which is 10% higher than women in France? Wow. There you go. Yeah. I could see that, though. Oh, yeah. I could definitely okay, see so that. Okay, so your turn, Melanie. <laughs> My turn. Yes. yes. <laughs> Tell us what you got over okay, here. Okay, so today <laughs> I have the nudes. Let's start with the nudes because they're front and center. Um, I think that all black girls should have a good nude, okay. point blank period. Find your right nude, trial and error, go to Sephora, go to Ulta, go to the drugstore even, and just pick out a bunch of them because if you have a nude lip color that works for you, mm -hmm. you are set. You can run out the house, you still look good, you don't have to worry about putting on a full face of makeup, and it's just good to have in your makeup now, bag. Now just to be clear, when you say nude, should it match your skin tone or your so, lip tone? Because your are lips are a little lighter than your actual skin. Right. Mm -hmm. So. Me personally, I feel like That's it should be. That's a good be, question. It is a great question. Because some people I, have different color lips from mm -hmm. their skin. Exactly. And so, yeah. Okay, go I ahead. I usually go <laughs> a shade lighter or a shade darker. It just really depends on your complexion and the color of your lips. Sometimes okay. nudes have like a pink That's undertone. What that looks like. <laughs> and it just looks better. And now, I see a lot of people testing this out. Is that how you should test your mm -hmm. lipstick on you your can. hand? The, diff the problem with that is if you have, like, I have pink lips, mm -hmm. like naturally pink lips. So right. if you have pink lips, you actually want to take it home and play around with it or ask okay. for a sample. Like, a lot of times they'll give you a sample. That's okay. Mm -hmm. So why do you think lipstick is so popular before we move to the next colors? Mm -hmm. Because, you know, there's blush, there's eyeshadow, but it seems like lipstick is the most enduring of them all. You know, I think lipstick is, A, the cheapest way to change up your makeup routine. Oh, that's true. And it is, in a sense, the safest. Black women especially are still ant antsy about blush. We're like, mm, mm. we don't know how it's supposed to look. What color should we do? We don't always know how to apply it correctly. Sometimes people have blush all the way up here. Like, yeah. <laughs> blush is tricky. <laughs> Mascara, you can't really see the difference unless you, like, completely pile it on sometimes. And we've all okay. seen that woman who looks like Raggedy Ann. Exactly. Yeah. Mm. And she looks yeah. crazy. We don't want that. Yeah. And we don't want that. No. And no. then shadows are tricky because every woman doesn't know how to apply mm -hmm. eyeshadow. But it, it, every it can woman be knows hard. how to use lipstick. Every woman. Okay. You don't so what are the colors that you bring? <laughs> okay, so I'll go to the reds because yes. I think that every woman of any shade should have, should have a their red. perfect red. Okay. That takes a while to find. Don't be, you know, afraid to Test outside the waters. I love bright reds, mm -hmm. but then I have a friend who loves deep reds. Yes. Mm. I always say that if you know your undertone, 
you'll easily find your red. Okay. okay. Um, so let's move My on. red is Mac Ruby Woo. That's everybody's red. Yeah, oh, that's everybody's red. And any, I don't know how they did it. Any girl of any complexion should have that color in her and makeup. And every bag. girl can wear it. I don't mm -hmm. know. Mac just hit the. They hit it on the nail. What yes. about girl. this turquoise looking one? I don't think every woman can wear that. <laughs> no. <laughs> so the thing. Certainly I'm, not the woman sitting right next to you. Actually, wow. you could. I think you at would be better with the gloss on top of it. But honestly, <laughs> this trend. <laughs> this trend is the bold trend. The bold lip yeah, color trend. Very. Very bold. That what actually looks that? nice on. You. <laughs> <laughs> but with the bold this trend, is a little young. This is for when you're in your twenties, right? Yeah. Have fun, Just play around. Yeah, you know, if you want to have fun, okay. or Halloween. The young, the summer. young girls in the They're audience like, yes, are girl, like, "Let me bring get me that. that." Okay, we have to go through a fire round real quick. What are the other okay. ones you have? Real okay, quick? so the other ones we have are purples. Um, Black Opal has a really great purple that I love. Okay. And uh, Obsessive Compulsive Cosmetics has a really good deep. Blue. It's like super rich. It almost looks black. And then last Ooh. but not least, we have our uh, corals. Okay. We did the cor yeah, we did pink's corals. <laughs> <laughs> are you? Are you? She, she's, uh, she's jacking your no, lipstick. I don't know, I'm, I'm, I'm so before we this. go, what's the key to making sure your lipstick lasts all day? Because you Get hear all these liner. commercials. Women okay. always buy lipstick and they don't buy liners. I don't understand. Get a liner. Yes. Get oh, a liner. Right. The Ask them. Huh. And that's okay. what it makes it last. I mean, yes. Learn so much on National Lipstick Melanie, Day. you've been <laughs> awesome. So Thank Look you. Look over there while I... While Lola <laughs> stuffs her Sorry. pockets. Oh. And we'll be right back <laughs> with more Rise Entertainment we 360. We are on camera. <laughs> oh, we're on camera. <laughs> Shoot. <laughs>